What's up you guys? I'm gonna be making grilled cheese sandwich, but first off, let me know who is watching. I wanna say hello to Mama Wuma, and uh, we're gonna make some grilled cheese sandwich. Let me know if you can hear me. Let's see if this actually is working right now. It is, okay, we can listen, we can listen. All right, there we go. Now there's gonna be an echo. Want to say hi to Sweet and Spicy family, Monica, Johnson family, A. Gomez, uh, Alexandra, what's up? I'm gonna make some grilled cheese. Let's get right into the ingredients. Uh, super easy recipe here. And uh, we've got our bread. I'm using a slight sourdough. So it's not a full sourdough, but it's got a nice little kick to it. For our cheeses, we've got some Gruyere with cheddar, as well as some bacon. And you gotta use the scallions, green onions in your grilled cheese. A lot of people don't do it, but it adds a lot of flavor. And I've got some room temperature butter here going on. So we're gonna go ahead and put together our grilled cheese sandwich. You can use two hands if you want. I've got Chris behind the camera, you guys say hi. Um, just wanted to continue saying hi to some other people right now. Uh, Davika, Francis, uh, Talia, I hope you enjoy this. All right, let's get down right to the sandwich. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually turn my heat on right now and I'm going to butter my bread. Now it's really important that you have room temperature butter so that you can spread your butter easily onto your sliced pieces of bread. Now you can use a French bread if you want, uh, but sourdough is just, it's got the best flavors. And you know, oftentimes when you actually go to like grilled cheese, food trucks, they're using a sourdough there too. So I like to get it right on the edges. Do that for the other side. Uh, if you guys have questions, go ahead and feel free to ask them right now. Uh, once I butter this bread, I'm gonna go ahead and start stacking all the ingredients. So another thing I like to do that's a little bit different is I like to add a little bit of the cracked pepper. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Bam. All right, so let's uh, let's go ahead and stack this, but let's answer a question. Um, let's see here, ask a question if you have. Um, how are the baby bears? They're actually upstairs, so I will be calling them down here soon and feeding them this grilled cheese. I think Judy's probably hungry, so we'll uh, go ahead and make her a grilled cheese first. Actually, you know who's hungry is Chris. He's actually behind the camera right now. Uh, let's see how this okay, is she looking. Can have one first. She can have one first. Go yes. ahead and Chris, get a little bit closer. <clears throat> As you can see, it's important to have a lot of cheese. I'm gonna have cheese on both sides of the ingredients. So, got my bacon here. I'm just gonna put on nice and neat. Guys, green onions. A lot of people don't use green onions, but uh, you can raise up the camera a little bit, Chris. There we go, there you go, right there but it actually adds a flavor that contrasts with the cheese and the bacon even, and a little bit of a slight crunch. As you can see, this is gonna be on the inside, so it's not gonna really get cooked out. It's all good, <clears throat> still gonna be delicious. And then what I do is I go ahead and add more cheese. Now, I, I totally forgot what kind of cheese I used uh, on the bottom, but I'm gonna go ahead and add this cheese. Plenty of cheese, it's all good. Hang on, I'm just adding a couple more pieces right there. Woo! I can't wait to get this onto the cast iron pan. So, Chris, let's go ahead and go out a little bit wide. I want to talk about the pan. So right now we've got we've got the pan heating up. I'm using a cast iron pan, which is perfect because it holds a lot of the heat and I've got it nice and warmed up. You don't need any oil. There's still some grease from the last grilled cheese I made, but we're gonna go ahead and focus the camera right here now and start cooking. We just had a super chat too. Oh, thank you for the super chat. Who is that? Uh, I'd say thank you to Chandler for the $20 super chat. I appreciate you guys supporting what Judy and I do here. Ah, this, Does that look good, Chris? Oh yeah. Does it look good? Oh, you hear that sizzle? I don't know if you guys hear that sizzle or not way up there. Uh, give a thumbs up if you guys hear the th sizzle. Oh, 
So this is a trick. You put the cover on like this, and I'm using a cover that's uh, a slightly smaller than the cast iron pan. And then we just wait. In fact, I'll set a timer. Boom, three minutes. All right, <clears throat> let me answer some questions. Let me know where you guys are watching from as well. Again, thank you so much to Chandler for the super chat. Let's see, we've got, <clears throat> um, does, Nicole asked, does the cast iron make the grilled cheese yummier? It absolutely does. It actually creates charring and some caramelization that other pans just can't mimic. That's because of the residual heat in the pan itself. So it holds a lot of that uh, energy from the stove. Um, <clears throat> Sandra from Houston says, Houston loves you all. Thank you so much, we love you as well. I'm here in Seattle. Uh, Kay Sira says she's from Honolulu. Uh, Honolulu, Honolulu, so aloha. Let's see, any other questions here? Someone asked, uh, Leah asked, what type of cheese are you using? So I'm using two different kinds of cheese here. I'm using a medium cheddar cheese right here. I don't know if it's focused or not using a medium cheddar cheese, plus I'm using Havarti cheese. So those are the two cheeses. Another one that's really good is, what is that cheese? Gruyere cheese. If you had caramelized onions, that would be even better. Let's see here. Um, Geno's, uh, Geno's from London. <clears throat> We've got Sanaa from the UK. Any more questions before I get move on to the grilled cheese? Um, loving you and please post more cooking videos. We got some delicious ones coming. In fact, I'm gonna go live again later and show you how I make my pasta sauce. But we've got a couple uploads coming up in the next few days. Kelly from the Philippines um, says, it inspires me a lot. I think she's talking about our family. Uh, thank you so much, I appreciate you watching. Melina asked, what kind of bread? I'm using a sourdough bread, but you can use a French bread if you want. Juliana, are you hungry? <clears throat> yeah, I didn't get any breakfast at school. What? Come over here. Come over here and say hi to everybody. Come over here. So Juliana just got home. Chris, you can bring that camera over. Look, you want to see? We're on, we're on here. See? Look, that's you. I'm making grilled cheese, little one. You want to say hi to everybody? Hi. Do you want to ask? Go ahead and look at that camera and ask them what kind of, what kind of emoji do you want? She loves emojis. Unicorn. unicorn so give us some unicorn emojis on the chat and hit that like button if you guys are loving this live broadcast of this grilled cheese all right Juliana I'm gonna show you some uh, deliciousness so this hope oh, is not burnt but we'll check it out Chris you can come up closer to here look at this Ooh. The unicorn emojis, I see that. you see the unicorn emoji yeah. that's awesome look, daddy I see unicorn yeah. emoji. Okay, let's see if this is burnt I or not. See -hoo 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 -hoo! That see? is perfect. You see, I put I the black see. pepper on the outside so that the heat can activate that peppery goodness. And we're gonna go ahead and let that sit for another two minutes. Boom. Daddy, I see you doing it. All right, here. come back over here, Chris. Get a close up of me and Juliana. So uh, let's see. Here, you hold this, Juliana, hold and what? let's read some of the questions. I saw unicorn. Someone asked, what, is, what setting is your stove on? Medium? It's actually on low right now, but when I first heat up the pan, it's like medium high. Let's see here. Um, and Lupita asked, how long on each side? So for my pan specifically, it's three minutes on the first side, and it just set it for two minutes on the other. Do you have any questions for anybody, Juliana? Mm -hmm. Or any other emojis that you would like? What's that? Emoji. What kind of emoji? Uh, emoji. Uh, uh, what? Oh, oh that, the, uh, uh, the face with the... Uh, the wings, he wings, and then he sticks out his tongue. All right, all right. So... I have that kind of emoji. Nicole asks, what is your favorite snack, JB? Mm-mm. Cake. Cake. Uh, cupcake. Mm-hmm. Goldfish. Mm-hmm. 
Cheddar buddies, mm -hmm. gummies, nice. fruit snack. Yeah. Beef jerk. Nice. There you go. Beef jerk. I didn't know about that one. Hey, do you want to get your chair and sit over here? What chair? Go get a chair. <laughs> Don't get that one with a cord on it. Here, in fact, uh, let me go ahead. Put this over to you. Okay. Here. You gotta be very careful on this chair, okay? okay. Watch out. Wait, uh, over here, over here, over here, over here. Can I taste it? Yes, you can. So we're gonna go ahead. So Chris, go can ahead. Can I bring help you, Dad? You can absolutely help me on the next one. Do you want to go uh, wash your hands real quick? Go wash them in the bathroom. Be, be careful of this uh, cord. All right, so this is just about finished. The timer is about to go off. I'll turn it off here. You can actually get down close here, Chris, because I'm gonna go ahead and smash it a little bit and this is why you want to use a lid that is slightly smaller than your pan um, I don't know if you can hear it Chris can you hear it on any of these sounds partially yeah partially we have another um, super chat from Ooh. Lizzie V for 1999 hey Lizzie thank you so much for your super chat I really appreciate you guys supporting us um, every time you guys give a super chat you support all the videos that happen on this channel oh, I wish you could see Julian, are you excited? Yeah. All right, come on. We're gonna go ahead and take this out now. Take what out? The grilled cheese. Ready, Chris? You want mm -hmm. cheese, Daddy? Yeah, you can eat. Oh, yeah, you can eat the cheese. Oh, oh, oh! Woo hoo hoo hoo! Look at that. There's bacon. It there looks is bacon. The one that I ate at school. Yeah, it looks like the one you ate at school. Uh huh. All right, let's go ahead and cut it real quick. Can I help? Make the next one. How about that? Okay. Look at this. Oh, oh, oh my. Oh my, oh my, oh my. All right, Juliana, we're going to let those cool. And why not help me with the next sandwich? So go ahead and put some bread on there. Two. Two of them. But what we're, we're going to do is we're going to. Get these two cheeses. Yep, get those two cheeses. Both Actually, no, them? we got some cheese right here. But first, what we got to do is butter the bread. Butter. Yeah, do you want to you want to help? Yeah, Go ahead. You try it. All right, Chris, let me know. Are there any questions? This is your opportunity. Oh, no. It's okay. Go ahead. Spread it on there. Uh, ask any questions. Uh, Juliana, who's your favorite Disney princess from Talia? What's Talia? No, Talia is asking you what your favorite Disney uh, princess is. Um, um. Ariel and Rapunzel. There you go. We got another question, like a grilled cheese related question. Is that special butter? So this is Kerrygold butter, which is a butter from Ireland, and it's very delicious. This is just what we use all the time. I think it's pasture raised cows, and it's very good, but it's at room temperature. It's important that it's room temperature so it spreads just like this. All right, Juliana, here, let me finish this one up, and then I will uh, butter the other side, okay? Do you want to help put all the uh, ingredients on? Yeah. Uh, Chris, you can get back in here now. Uh, go cheese. ahead and focus. Cat cheese. Yes, you can have some cheese. Oh, watch your. Um, so a little trick here is this slice is a little small, so I'm going to flip it. And then it gives you a little bit more area to put butter on there. Wow. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. There we go. All right, Juliana, you can help now. Go ahead, we need to put some cheese on this one first. Go ahead and put it on there. There you go. No, on this one side first. This right, right on top. There you go, perfect. Then I need to get some bacon. Now, we made some bacon earlier, Juliana. Um, it's a little bit burnt, but guess what? It's okay that it's burnt because the gooiness of the cheese will actually soften it a little bit. Actually, first we need to put some green onions. You want to do that? Just sprinkle it right on top. There we go. Good job. I'm going to sprinkle a little bit more. There we go. Perfect. All right. Now go ahead and put that on top. Oh, flip it. There you go. Flip it. One more. There you go. Just like that. All right, Juliana, how about you do me a big favor? You can come up. Do me a big favor and go tell mommy you just finished her grilled cheese. So we need her to do a taste test, okay? Well, yeah, yeah, you'll taste it with uh, mommy, okay? <laughs> She's gonna be okay. All right, so we're gonna do this one more time. 
Let's bring it over here to cast iron pan. There we go, it's nice and hot right now. I'm gonna turn up that heat real quick. Same thing, I'm gonna go ahead and press it down. If you guys have any uh, questions about grilled cheese, about cooking, go ahead and feel free to ask right now. So I'm gonna have to turn this on. Chris, tell me if the uh, sound is okay. Sounds good. All right, any questions while I'm cutting this up? You wanna get it close here, Chris? Yeah. Um, someone asked, what's your favorite dish cooked by Benji? Oh, that's for me. Um, I think your bolognese sauce is really yeah, good. Yeah, bolognese, and guess what? Which is up next. We're gonna be making bolognese next and we're gonna be doing it live, so that's cool. They want a taste test for this. Yes. Well, hopefully Judy comes here soon. Hey, honey, you want a taste test this grilled cheese? <clears throat> Ooh. Mia, Kira, I've got grilled cheese for you. How about this? But uh, we'll just leave that one here. Where do you get your pans from? Um, so this pan I just got from a cooking shop that sells cast iron. But uh, normally I buy things these days online. Nice. Let's do a taste test with you, Chris. All with right. Me? Yes, with All you. All right. Here we go. All right. Here we go. This is Ooh. this is it right here. Right I don't there? know how. Uh, well, let's switch. You're good. Let's switch. You, no, you go okay. over here. Okay. All right. Sorry, you guys. It's all shaky. All right. Okay. Let's see. So Chris Ooh. is gonna taste that one right there. Yeah, on your oh, left. Oh man. There you go. Tell wow. Me how it tastes, Chris. Oh. Mm hmm Yeah. Mm hmm <laughs> How good is that? Mmm. You like that? Any thoughts? Any comments? The cheese is really rich. A good rich. Yes. How's that bread? Soft. Mm hmm <laughs> No, it's good because usually Let's show people what you're eating mm -hmm. right now. So that is the final grilled cheese that I cut up for the girls because I like to make them bite sized so it's easy for them to eat. Hopefully Judy comes down here. Oh, Chris, the we bacon, gotta switch. Though. We gotta switch. But the bacon though. The bacon? The bacon. Oh, you got the bacon? Oh, you got it. All right. Oh, I forgot. I got grilled cheese on the pan right now. Go ahead and get it on here. So this one, if it's a little burnt, that is okay. In fact, here, let me, uh, little try. Ooh! There we go. We're in business. Mm-hmm. Oh, Judy's gonna love that one. So, you go ahead and cover it. And this, what this actually does is not only keep some of the heat in there to continue to help uh, melting the cheese, but also it lets the steam it's escape because there's that gap. There you go. So, Judy's about to come down here and we're gonna finish this live recipe that we're doing here on my channel. I am Benji Travis. If you guys are new here, make sure you hit that like button and comment below what's your favorite type of grilled cheese sandwich and also consider subscribing. Uh, any other questions, Chris? He's choking because he's loving the uh, grilled cheese so much. So I'm, let me ask you. I'm chewing. <laughs> let, me, let me, go ahead. Uh, let me get uh, your questions here. Bam, all the way. So, Kyle says, yay, Judy, if she ever comes down, we'll see. Um, love you love as tomato soup recipe, please. We'll, we'll see, I'm not, I, I'm not really a big <coughs> tomato soup guy in terms of cooking it. I just buy it, but we'll see. Um, Julie asks, can you make a video on how to season a cast iron skillet? maybe in the future. I actually have not seasoned this in a very long time, so I'd have to brush up on that. And Cassie asked, what kind of uh, cheese did you use? Again, I used a Havarti today, as well as a medium cheddar. Let's see here. Joyful asked, seafood lasagna. That actually sounds really good. I've actually never tried that, but that sounds amazing. Mary Mary at, or says, I love grilled cheese. Well, I love grilled cheese too. That's why we're doing this recipe. Mm -hmm. uh, this is almost done. Let me add that the bacon. Yeah. 
the perfect smokiness yes. to that grilled cheese. Yeah, it's good. It's good stuff. Um, Miss Aliza asks, where can you get that cheese at? So you can basically get both of those at any grocery store. Now that specific one I get at my co-op. So we're gonna go ahead and remove, yeah, there you go. That's the cheese that I'm using. Rumiano family organic cheese is good stuff. We're gonna go ahead and remove this and we're gonna finish it. Hey Judy, you wanna taste this grilled cheese? Okay. Yes. <laughs> hey, Kat, can you go get the twins too and tell them that? Oh, tell them that this is done for them. Look at that. Oh, oh. The lighting is amazing. Look at that. Look at that. Josh, thank you so much for your super chat support. Oh, I just that. I can't read your Korean writing or Miko, is it? Let me go ahead and get this here. Go ahead and, uh, oh yeah. yeah. Just hold it there. All right. We're gonna go ahead and crush this for you. Ready? Whoo! Oh boy. Okay. Juliana, come here. I've got uh, a few here for you to taste test. Okay? okay. All right. So go ahead and get it back wide, <laughs> and Juliana's going to try one? these ones right here. Okay. All right. Go ahead. I Tell me what you think about it. We can try. Yep. thumbs up is JB approved we're gonna be coming out with this recipe video here soon a shorter version but if you guys enjoyed this live broadcast hit that like button one more time and comment below what is your favorite type of grilled cheese I guess Judy's not gonna join us but sh you better believe she's gonna try this so uh, anything you want to say to everybody before we uh, stop this I you if you didn't hear that because she's uh, chomping on this grilled cheese, says she hopes you make this. All right, you guys. We'll talk to you later. Bye. <laughs>